What's up, YouTube? It's your boy T2, T2 the Great, Triple OG. Yeah, you know me. How's everybody doing? Once again, we here back with the Rav Rover uh, 4, 5. Now, anyway, this guy bought this bike to me last night because uh, the bike completely stopped. He can't get the bike to run. But there's several things that's real wrong with the bike. I have the battery down here charging up right now. But um, I noticed there's a lot of damage to the bike. Like, for instance, this right here is broken off. It's pretty minor, but that's no major issue. And I don't know what happened here, but his whole gear shifter is smashed. So I guess he would like to replace that. And also, his headlight needs to be fixed. And the seat clamp is jammed in. This doesn't move. Now, I don't know why this bike is not running. I don't know if it's due to the battery. I don't know if it's due to the controller. Or I don't know if it's the display. But we're gonna check it out. And also, the bike is missing the brake cable. So, we're gonna touch this bike up, clean it up, get this bike, this guy, get this guy back on the road and running in. You guys stick around. It's your boy, T2. Okay, guys, so for some reason, I believe that it's the display that's causing the, the, the bike not to power on. I believe the whole display is busted out. So I have my old Rad Rover here. This display is banged out, but it works. So I'm going to swap this display over here to see if this bike, if I can cut the bike on with a new display. If it works, that's the problem. It's a bad display. So that's what we're going to do right now. Swap the display from here to here to try it out. And let's get right into that right now, guys. So this is the test display that we use to power up the bike. It works, it's busted, it's over, but it's a test display. So let's connect this up. Um, take the arrow, connect it to the next arrow, if you guys can see that there. Just get it to them, and you roll it tight. So let's test it. And this one will test it. So it worked. And that's exactly what it is. It's his display. His display is busted. Now let's give another test of the twist throttle. So that's exactly what's looking like it's wrong. The throttles. His throttle is broken. I mean his display is broken. Okay, right there. Here. Let me grab this up here. Sorry guys. Give me a second to just fix this up. Okay, you guys can see that. So we're powering up here. And you see it's on. This is his, this is the test display. The test display hanging there. Now, I gotta lift this bike up to, to test it. Oh, one second. No back brakes. <laughs> so, okay, guys, I'm gonna call this guy, let him know that his bike is up and running, and um, you know, I'm all over with it. Just to let you guys know. So, I swapped out the display already, you know, it's sitting nice and solid. This is on there tight. I'm gonna call him, you know, the bike works, it, it powers on now, he's good, he can ride. I'm pretty sure that's all he wanted. But if he wanted to do this shifter, I can do the shifter here. I mean, because I have another shifter right here. I can swap this shifter here and put it right here. So if you want to do the shifter, that's no problem. And as far as the brake cable, I have a brake cable here. I have a brake cable that he can put right in here. He's missing the whole brake cable. 
So I have the brake cable I can take care of. This, I'll do this for him. But, oh yeah, and also I can adjust that, that's no problem. I think a lot of these things here is teetered, so I don't have to do it on, on online, show you guys. But, and even like, if you wanted to, um, to swap these tires out, I see his tires are going bald. I got brand new tires here. Like I said, these haven't even touched the dirt yet. So if you need new tires, I got new tires here. Brand new. Let me check his back tire. Well, his back tire still has some life, so he's good. So if you need the front, well, it's best to change the set. It's so whatever you want to do. So I'm going to notify the guy, let him know that I got the bike up and running. If he want to do more work, you guys are more than welcome to watch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? That's the way I keep these videos going. And we had 750 subscribers. Guys, I really, really appreciate it. To all my Ebros, thanks a lot. And I'll catch you guys a little later. Maybe we'll have a part two to this video. Maybe not. If not, but we got plenty more work to do. It's your boy, T2. See you later.